All right, so we're going to be doing division. We're going to be using the D scale, as we've done before with multiplication. And then we're also going to be using the CI and the CIF. And those are the reciprocal of the C scale. So our first number, the numerator, is 4.5. Let's move over to 4.5. Index it right there. All right, so I've got index to 4.5. And I'm going to look at my inverted scale. And here's 7, and it's going backwards. That's what the arrow sign means. So I need 7.8. So move over to my hairline of 7.5, 6, 7, 8 right about there, and then read off the number on the D scale. So I've got 5.567 right there, so about 5.76 or so. And if we look at here, oh yeah, I'm remembering the tens place, so it's going to be about 0.5, so 0 0.576, 0 0.577, somewhere right around there is what we read off. All right. Let's do the next number, which is kind of a chain calculation. So I've done 3.3 divided by 15, and then multiply that by 12.5. So our first number is going to be 3.3. So let's index 3.3 right there. And then multiply by our, or divide by our second number, 15 on the C scale. Now, our inverted scale, I could go off the other end, but I'm just going to use the folded scale because I have my uh, ones right here. So one, two, and three. So I need 1.5. So I've got one, 1, 1.1, 1 .1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So move it over to there. All right, now I've got my hairline set so I can move over to the next calculation. I'm still going to be using the folded scale though, so I need to move over to the one here on the folded scale. And then our last number is 12.5. So if I look down here on my C, I'm going to fold back into the C scale, so 1.25 Move my hairline over to there. And my final answer is going to be 2.1234567. And then right about in the middle. So probably about 2.75 or so. And that's exactly what, what it is. So we got pretty close on that one.